How's it, Sean from Combat Simulations? Welcome to the second West German campaign. The first scenario is called The Wolves. Wolves. All right, so before we get started, please subscribe to my channel. It's free. And also leave comments and suggestions and watch my videos. Uh, you know, it helps me a lot. I promise you it does. Right, I thought <clears throat> in the previous scenario, when the when I finished the last West German campaign, I thought there was a British campaign. And then when I looked again, I, I saw that there was there's only a US, there's a US, um, um, US, Soviet, West German, and there's this Wolves campaign. This Wolves scenario, Wolves, uh, it's a West German 10 battle campaign. I actually didn't, I didn't, I thought there was a British campaign. It's a pity because they have enough units, they've got enough stuff, uh, units in the game for a British campaign. I don't know why they didn't do a British campaign. It's a pity. I was looking forward to that. Anyway, this is uh, the second uh, uh, Wolf's uh, uh, West Germany campaign. All right, so it's a 10 battle campaign. Uh, 27th of July 1989. In the days following the attack of the Soviet forces of the First Guards tank, the Soviet forces of the First Guards tank army made moderate gains on their way on their way to the Rhine through the West German Third Corps area of operations. They made slower progress than was expected. The Corps was still required to pull back to protect the flanks of the U.S. Fifth Corps as they fell back. A unique unit of the Bundeswehr had was activated the hundred the well <clears throat> the thousand and first panzer grenadier uh, became operational the unit what had been termed as stay behind unit its entire function was to operate behind Warsaw Pact lines if they should ever advance this deeply into Germany this unit was highly trained had the best equipment was all an all volunteer force recruited from the local area and had numerous supply depots within 150 uh, kilometer radius of its main base. The unit was highly motivated to fight, and being in the rare areas of the rear areas of the Soviet advance, they were uniquely positioned to cause tremendous havoc to the Soviet high command. This series of actions are a mix of attack and defend, cat and mouse actions, in which it may be difficult to tell who is the attacker or the defender. The roles may change with little or no notice. All right. So, what's our mission briefing for the Wolf's mission? Uh, yeah, the first tanks are, uh, tanks, tank army has advanced past second operational area. We are hereby ordered to begin operations in the Soviet rear areas. Effective immediately. Uh, Panzer uh, Grenadier Brigade 1001 is activated. Our orders are as previously stated. We are to cause as much deb destruction and havoc as possible. It's important that we limit our losses. It will be impossible to get new equipment to us. We are possibly we can possibly get new men dropped on our look, on an occasion, but too many resupply missions may give the service an idea of where our main forces are. All right. Mission. Our first mission is to attack the supply columns of the first tanks tank army on the road from Oh Undersheldorf. I can't pronounce it. And Eliendorf and Heicher and Flammersbach and Dillenberg and Berg. Okay. Yeah. We are to destroy as many Soviet formations that we encounter along this road net, as well as creating an atmosphere of confusion and insecurity, creating a situation where we will have to to employ security for where they will have to employ security forces in areas uh, they did not think would be a worry to them all right so friendly forces the recon company 1001 artillery company 1001 intelligence reports we've gotten from the 11th acr said that the soviet assault uh, was made with a large number of tanks and ivs the initial assault forces are without a doubt on the move deep into Germany. If they are in fact in Fulda, they have reached their initial objective to break through our border defences. There is a report of an engagement along Route 2, 258 around the town of Nordheim van Ruen, but at this time we are not sure of the outcome of that encounter. The Soviets seem to be attacking al along all main and secondary hard-topped roads in the Fulda Gap. They are in division strength and with the high well, strength with a high likelihood that the chain of command is much higher. 
probably all the way to the western probably all the way to western forces germany <coughs> which could mean that army supporting level units soviet forces will be he will be heavy elements with all supporting arms present Take that into account when we engage them. Okay, so you're making me worried now. Okay, res reserves. There are no reinforcements being made available as we speak. The first available artillery battalion that comes online will be tasked with to support our advance. I have no idea when they will be operation, but I would think within a two-hour frame uh, time frame we will have their support. Aftermath: a large scale. This first large scale engagement of the war was not what either side had been trained for. The rain squalls kept visibility, visibility low. This helped the Soviets greatly to get in close to the 3rd Armored uh, Division tanks, but it also kept them from pushing the advantage as much as they might have, and helicopters flying in and out of the rain to unleash torrents of rockets was unsettling. The Soviet air defense wasn't nearly as effective as advertised uh, in these bad weather conditions. All right, so that that was quite a, 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 a story there. So there's our campaign history. So we're starting. It's a 10-battle campaign, and it, the first scenario is called Wolves. Right, so what's our... We need a 50% decisive success. Tactical success is 44%. Contested battle, 27 to 35. So we don't need that high of a success. But we have a task at our hands, because if you look... There's, there's basically just four 500 victory hex points. There's a 500 there, there's a 500 there, there's a 500 there, and there's a 500, 500 there. The Soviets own them. Now we have six, six, uh, four thousand, four and a half thousand worth of victory points in units. He has over eight thousand. So he's sort of in a defensive uh, situation here, and we're sitting in the woods and trees again. So. Yeah, I'm just not sure. I wasn't sure how to set this up, but I set it up the best I could. Here's the spaghetti. Well, let's just look at the... What do we have? All right, so... This is our campaign, the, the 1001 Panzer Grenadier uh, Battalion. That's These are all our core units. And they're behind, apparently, like, behind enemy lines. <coughs> so, we've got some decent units. I mean, we have... We only have one section of Panther 2s, Leopard 2s, sorry. And then the rest is just infantry. And we've got we've got a recon company over there. We've got an artillery brigade, which is carrying these these uh, 109s, which are good. I mean, they've got an 8 area, fairly dense, and they've got a long range. Um, then we have infantry, right? Mechanized infantry. Okay, Panther Grenadiers. We have some mortars. And we have some more sort of infantry. Well, these these guys are also Panzer Grenadiers, but they go in this M113, uh, yeah, GA track vehicle. This thing is look at the protection; it's nothing. In fact, these vehicles, these Marauders, are better, way better. They've at least got, you know, they've got armament. They haven't got great benign protection, but they got a little bit of. You know, like area fire, and they have a little heat going on. Whereas these things are nothing. You know, these guys that are traveling in this thing, they're, they're just, yeah, they've got no chance. So they probably kept them back. So what have I done? All right, let's have a look. Okay, so I've sent the tanks in. I've delayed this infantry in these little death cars here. This section of infantry. They're going to go in afterwards and take these exes. Uh, what I've, my overall plan is this. Let's do this hex by hex. Because there's no use weakening, weakening our forces and sending infantry in there, and then infantry in there, and then infantry in there. There's no concentration of force. So let's, so what I've done is let's, I'm going to concentrate all my force and get one hex. Then I'm going to concentrate all my force and get the next hex. And then the next hex. I'm going to use a, series of concentrated fights so this is what i've done with the first one i said my panthers into these reaches in well into the town yeah but with good lines of sight they're going on they're moving deliberately and in there and they're ahead they're going to go in first these guys i've delayed I've delayed by 20 minutes 
So the tanks are first going to go in there and soften up everything that's in there. And then these hoes are going to come in. One section of infantry with the marauders. I've put here in the... Let me just take this. Let me just... I've put here in this ridge here. And they're going to just go in there and dig in on hold on this road. Stopping it from coming down there. And this is the first time I've done this with, the, with another section. I've taken another section of marauders. Alright, so... They're going to go through the trees. All right. They're going to advance through the trees, through this bush, and get there, and get there, and get there. So three of them are going to get in there. Enough time to arrive at the same time. Not to worry. These, by the time these guys get there, this infantry will sort of be only coming. So that's what... And then the scout's gone in there. I've sent a scout in there. And I've sent a scout up here, and a scout uh, down there. Well, down there and going back there. Just to see what's going on there. I've sent... <coughs> so that's three infantry... Mechanized infantry companies going in to support this whole thing here. Now I've got a... There's, I've got a fourth one. Now the fourth company is going to go up this road and just sit here. Just sit here. They're not going to go in there. Because you really can't go into a place without tanks, man. Combined arms is very important, and tanks you need. You need tanks to soften up. You know, infantry is fine, but tanks need to take care of all the infantry and also the, un the tanks that are, if there's tanks here, you need the tanks to go in there and support your infantry. So there's no ways I'm going to send infantry into there and try and occupy through all these little gullies. So I've put a section of infantry here. And they're just going to go and hold it. So when you finish this, we're going to go up this road and tackle that. And then this infantry can help. But they're just going to be, they're not going in here as well. They're just going to, they're just going to park off over there. And that's it. That's what I've done. Yeah, hope it works. And uh, let's have a look now. So yeah, I've gone through that. So the electronic hindrance, warfare hindrance is high. So there's a 33% penalty to all our orders. Right, delays. We are at 80 minutes, 18 minute cycle. He's at 37. We've got good quality troops. I mean, if you look at our tanks, I mean, they're all, they're elite. Top of the line. I mean, really, this is, these for volunteer guys, these guys are elite. Everything's elite. I mean, there's no veterans here. Oh, there are veterans. Okay, so we do have some veterans. But generally, <coughs> we've got some elite, we've got elite and veteran units. And the infantry seems to be veteran, but the tanks are elite. So we've got good stuff. Uh, we have had 83 orders an hour, which is okay. It's not too bad. We gave, we gave a lot of orders. It's 18 minutes to our orders. It's 12 o'clock on July the 27th. It's it's a seven-hour scenario. Uh, the days are clear. The visuals are clear. It's 5,000 meters, five kilometers. Uh, yeah, and also one more thing. I forgot, almost forgot. Um, yeah, so he's basically in this area. There he is. So he's right on top of us. He's all over here. We don't know where he is, but he's here. I don't know if he's waiting for us, but he's there. And there is some tanks here. 60 to seven, uh, 70 main battle tanks. So we've got a task ahead of us. Let's see if we can do it. All right, let's fight. Yeah, I don't want to just blunder in there. I want to just get my scout, just to, just to give me an idea and, and block this road here. It's the first time I sent guys through the woods. It'll take forever, but at least, because these guys are going to take 20 minutes, and these guys will get there when these guys are here. So it's not... Yeah, we want there's these guys on the road there too. <laughs> uh. 
Okay, so, alright, so, where are you shooting? Oh, no, you're going to shoot on there. Yeah, I actually want you to shoot on there. And you, yeah, you can carry on there, but let's put one on there as well. Or maybe, maybe one there. Because, you know, you never know, he's moving. Uh, yeah, and you, I actually want you to carry on there. I need some sight there. Yeah, I need more sight there. Are you, where are you guys? Are you guys are going up this road? All right, let's, I think that's all I want to do for now. Let's just get more vision, get more information here. Yeah. Okay, great. At least they're out of their cars, that's the important thing. That's what you want on that that ridge there. The thing with the Soviets, they the units are worth so little. You just, you know, you kill them and they're like one worth one point or two, three points or whatever. You've got to kill thousands of them to ever ever get them down to a trend. I mean eight thousand is a lot in, in terms of numbers. That's a lot of units. Yeah, that wrecky is going to die, but I need that side. I hope it's going stay. Yeah, okay, he's going to die. He's right in the middle here, but he's giving me good vision. Oh, he's dead. Okay, so we we know what's in there. There's, there's stuff in there. We need to get sight on it. I need to get sight on that stuff because unspotted artillery fire doesn't really help. I wish these mortars would move towards the battlefield a little bit. I mean, they were situated, yeah, now they're running all the way there. I don't care. These guys have got range of the battlefield, but not the mortars. Now we can see stuff. Where is he shooting? Oh, shucks. There's a whole section here. I wasn't looking. Oh, there we go. Good.
Okay, so why is there two O's in here? Is that a sk? Oh, shit. Where are you going? No, man. You're supposed to be there, you fool. How did you end up there? Gosh. You're supposed to be there. Why are you going in there? All right. That's fine. I need this road here. Okay, so let's just bomb. One, two, and three. Uh, let's bomb. One, two, and three. And where's my other guy? He's also run out of there. You're not bombing, eh? One, two, and three. All right, those then you. You're bombing, right? No, not there. Uh, go there for me, and then you. Uh, we need we need the center. Two and three. I need all everything in the center. I don't know why he's going in there. He's supposed to go there. Silly. All right, good. So we're gonna just what's over here? Is there anything? I've got to just give an eye. And I realize he's. Go down there, and you're still moving. All right, let's shoot. Okay, so we've got some infantry there. I want in that center and then on this this yeah he's got a ton of units I mean 8,000 sheesh we're probably not even close yeah like 600 units move tank I actually wanted you there I don't know how you ended up down there Slow these guys down a little bit. They're coming in too quick now for it. Because they got those little cars. I mean, those little cars are just. in the wrong place man he should have he shouldn't have been there I actually planned him to go down this gully here silly idiot yo jeez he's in the good he's in the cover there help me out there
Need them in the center. When are you going to move? You move to the wrong place, but you're just not moving. Hey. Now I got this infantry coming in here, and these oaks, this tank wasn't supposed to be there, it was supposed to be here, covering this line here. Now he ended up there. And he's not moving now. Oh jeez, this fool over here, he was supposed to be here. Because he covers this line, yeah. That's where I originally had him. Now this fool has moved over here. I don't know why he went there. <laughs> Good. Alright, so I'm going to have to... Alright, so these guys obviously are not going to be able to... I'm going to have to... I think I'm going to delay this. These waypoints. I'm going to delay them by... Until I can move those tanks in there. So I'm going to... I'm going to... When's our next uh, 23 minutes? I'm going to make them 25. Each. Okay. So that they move. So that I've got another chance to. Um, so I don't want them to go in right now. You with me? Uh, there. I don't want them to. Uh, oh, twenty-five. I don't want them to. And we'll make this also twenty-five. Let's just go, just in case something happens. So I want them to. This is all those waypoints. Let's make it in there. No. Yeah, let's make it in there. Waypoint there. Uh, yeah, now keep it there. Sorry, this, I'm just... And keep the one waypoint there. Keep the one waypoint there. Keep the one waypoint there. And then, uh, yeah. And this guy... Where's this guy that's going with a one waypoint? <coughs> uh, has he got 25? Yeah, okay. So they're going to just stop here until the silly tank gets in here. Stupid tank. Is he crossing a river? Is that why? Gosh, he got completely effed up here, this guy, man. He's having to cross a river as well. Yeah, so... Gosh, if he... what's he, What time is he going to get there? Alright, so he's going to... At 13 put minutes past, he's gonna. Oh no, 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 13. So at 5, okay, good. So that's a little bit better. So you'll get there at 5 past. Alright, let's just see if we can do some bombing here. Alright, you move because you were attrited. Yeah, but I need you, bro. On call. How many orders? 16, so I've got enough orders. One, two, and three. And you can also shoot. Call. Neutralize. I want you to... Yeah, I want you to... One, two, and three. And then these guys... You know, move there. Okay. And neutralize one, two, and three. 
All right, let's just look at the rest of the battlefield. Okay, yeah. All right, so he's in there and he's moving. But there was a O over here. Why are you going over there? There. There's where you need to go. And then he was killed. He got the X there and he was killed. Okay, good. All right, let's just see how this pans out. You're not supposed to be moving. I gave you 26 minutes to stop moving. Hey, I'm sure I timed you, Oak. I timed you. Why are you guys moving? I told you don't move in 27 minutes. Why are you now moving? I put a timer on these guys. I put a timer, 25 minutes or whatever. Why are they moving? Why are they moving? I put 27 minute timer on there. Who's he shooting at? Well, at least he moved. Don't ask me why he's moving. These guys over here. Why are they moving? I put 27 minute timers on these hoes. What the hell are they doing? I told them to delay. 27 minutes to get there. Why are they moving? Don't ask me why they're moving. I got no clue. No damn clue. I put I gave them 27 minute timers. 25 timers. You saw me do it. Why are they moving? Why are they constantly moving? I've given them the timers. Maybe it's a delay. Oh well jeez. That wasn't what I need wanted. Gave them a delay. Maybe it's Maybe it's a delay. Oh, it's irritating, man. I gave them a delay. Oh, jeez. Hey, you know what? This is irritating. Irritating. Okay, I told them to delay their movement.
Oh. Irritating, irritating. Oh, I've got to get them out of their cars because I want to look at these waypoints again. I told them to delay their waypoints. I might as well take his waypoint out. Okay, so he's come down here. Luckily, I put these guys on hold here. So they, they should be dug in here. What's over there? What's happening here? Uh, excuse me. When, when, you took the, the delay out, you fool. How, how the hell did you do that? Okay, at least you're out of your cars. That's important. You can go, you can go there. Yes, it's irritating, man. I gave them a delay. What was their, what was their story? And now you delayed. Yeah, well, that doesn't help. Let's take this out. Just move in. Move into there. Okay. And I might as well just take your delay out. I gave them delays. Maybe there's an orders delay to delays. Yeah, it might be. Okay, so you can go in there. You can go there. You can go, you know, just get into the hex. Okay, that's all I want you to do. Go in there, and you can go in there. So these two guys, he's moving in there. He's moving into that X. He's on his feet. He'll go in there as whatever. Who's underneath him? And he's got that. And then he'll go in there. Okay, that's probably the best. All right. Okay, so let's just see where we're going to be bombing. Let's bomb on that hill. No, no, no. I don't want to bomb there because I'm moving in there just now. How about moving there? You know, move, move a little bit closer. Okay, you keep moving because we know we had a bit of an issue there. And you can neutralize. What about there? And then there. And then there. Way in there. Let's see if we can get you on that road there. Uh, yeah, and you're moving. And you are bombing there. Yeah, all right. Let's play that out. Well, let's play this one out. Let's just see how this goes. Well, I did place him to be moved. So if he gets shot up, big deal. Oh, that's better. At least they're out of their cars. I want to see what happens up here. If we can get him over there. He's going down there. So we know there's something over here. some O's there. Well, we only got one O. We've got such little density artillery. Okay, let's have a look. He's got, he's got a fair amount of forces done. Obviously, this is all choked up here. There's O's over there and whatever. So let's try and get this hex. Leave this. You know what? Leave this as a holding thing. This saves this saves him. <coughs> saves us from him. Creeping up down here to grab this hex here. Yeah. So we're going to leave everything here and we're going to move up there. 
Yeah. Oh, yeah, come the tanks, obviously. How many we killed? Oh, yes, we're far off. I think. So he's dead there. So he's got some tanks over here. Some infantry there. We had something in there. Let's clear this out first. He's up. We can get the hex. <sighs> Was he moving in there or has he just decided to go on old? No, he's moving his around here. Yeah. I don't know if he's coming in here. Yeah. I've got no clue. Try to sneak up our backside here. Okay, so is he moving in there? No. Okay, I want I want one guy to move in there and go on hold. Okay, good. At least he goes in there. All right, so I've got quite a bit to plan now because now I'm going to move from this side to there. Okay, so let me just, I'm going to pause the video and make my plans and I'll get back to you. Okay, so basically I haven't done much. I actually was going to send these tanks, and I have to do it just now. Send them there, send one over here. But then I had looked at these damn hoes, and they're on 21% ammo. So if I send them down there, they're going to run out of ammo. That's not going to help me. So I had to re redo it and re put these guys on resupply. I moved these guys up, but I've delayed them because I've... First I set the tanks up, then I didn't realize that they were in resupply, and then I, so I've delayed them by 100 to move into these areas here. And i got no more orders to put them back on hold, so, so I'm just going to, these guys are going to resupply, let them just resupply that whole tank thing, and then we will take it from there. I hope he just doesn't bomb me now in my cars.
Oh. Now these tanks must resupply because they run out of ammo. You can't I can't bring them over there with no ammo. Just hope they resup they're gonna resupply now and after two. doesn't help. This is, I hope he doesn't blow any tanks up, man. I'll be the Murin. Jeez, the tanks ran out of ammunition. We're far from our goal here. When are you resupplying? Down now, right? Uh, when? At 14.13. Okay, let's go. Hang on, is there anything I can shoot at here? No. What about... Yeah, bomb there. That's a brilliant one. Alright, let's just play this out again so we can just get these tanks resupplied. Hey, I was moving in there, fool! Why didn't you move in there, you bloody idiot? Damn! Now you irritate me now. Okay, finally, resupply. Now he's in his damn car. Alright, good. Now move the hell in there. Okay, so my order. Alright, good. Now I'm going to send the tanks. Move deliberately. Okay, let me just plan these moves and I'll get back to you. I'll pause the video and come back. Okay, so basically he has the spaghetti. <laughs> okay. So what I've done now is these tanks are resupplied, so I've moved them up now. So they're full of ammo. Okay, there's no complaints about ammo. They have 100%, 95% ammo. So I've moved the tanks. Let me just put the spaghetti. I've moved the tanks. Take that off. I've moved the tank in there, I've put a tank, because they got, well, they had good lines of sight. Now they didn't have shit lines of sight. Where was the right? I've moved one tank in there, it's got good line of sight of the cover, that one's got good line of sight. Now when I had it, this was this was a decent line of sight. Oh, because it's 2,000 meters, that's why. Alright, so I'll put a tank in there for now. Um, let me take the line of sight out. I've moved this infantry into this hex, into these hexes. I've moved this section into these, into this forest here. Nice with cover, because I know there's something there. There was something there. So I've moved this whole lot. I've taken this infantry, this, inf this infantry here, this command here, this whole command here of mechanized infantry. They're moving into these hexes. They're moving in here. Okay, with the tanks on overwatch to watch them. This section of mechanized infantry, Panzer Grenadiers, I put in the ridges yet, and they're going to go on hold here because I, I think there's an O in there. All right. This command, this little 
uh, company here, I've moved them over here to, to cover these exact same positions that these O's had. Are you with me? So they're, they're going to cover that position here. This infantry here is going to hold this position. Right, while well, these guys are moving up. And I've put the mortars over here. That's it. That's what I've done. I hope this all works. Let's have a look. Let's just see. Because I've given it some time now. Because now the, the dam, these tanks ran resupplied. So it's no use moving these tanks up here with no ammo. I need them to overshoot. They need to be filled up with their, with their, uh, with their ammunition. So I had to wait now for that. Uh, yeah, and that's basically what I've done. So let's just see if this all works out. And I ran out of orders, obviously. Oh, that's his HQ. So we haven't killed a lot. It's 1,300 and... Something killed more than him, but it's just he's got eight thousand worth of units. I mean, he's packed up. We got this little force here. Oh no, not in my cars, man. Jeez. That's I wish. They stop firing at this infantry because this infantry is just useless to shoot at. Or better. Now this little force is going to hold this 500 here. Hopefully. Okay, so we need to blow on this bridge. Shucks. These guys are appearing out of nowhere. Alright, so I need to blow as much as I can on that bridge. Neutralize. Alright, and we'll put a second one on there. And neutralize. And we'll put a second one on there as well. Just keep blowing that thing. Anything up the road, yeah, no. And I'm going to neutralize. Where is he now? He's also going to neutralize. Neutralize. One, two. Okay, good. Just the two. And that should keep him busy. Alright. And then I'm holding with this little force over here. Alright, let's go. I think that's all I want to do for now. Oh, jeez, man. This guy decides now he's going to shoot these guys. And they're in their cars as well. Thank goodness for that. Just blown that lot out there. Alright, go on. Oh, no, I wasted some ammunition there. Overkill, I know. Alright, well, there you go. The tanks are going to run into these guys. So nine tanks coming down there. Ah, oh, shit. Oh, God. Alright. Who's this my HQ? 
No, stop. Uh, move there. Change your orders. Let's delete this. Until I clear out this little section that's coming here. Go back in there. Uh, let's just stop this little movement now. Damn it. Go in there and hold. In fact, you're not gonna you're not gonna make it. Can you see there? Yeah. So I have to delete this whole damn thing now. So you're gonna have to go back in there. And delete that waypoint. So you're gonna have to go back in there. And you you can't go anywhere now. Because you got a problem, yeah. Uh, yeah. All right, so let's put you back in there. What's this like? Yeah, that's good. What's that like? Yeah, no, that's okay. What about there? I think there. And we're going to have to delete these orders as well. All right, so go back in there. Um. Yeah, I still want you to do all this. So, let's just put you on hold. Okay. Let's just stop this whole movement until we clear this lot out. Hold. Uh, you were going there. No. Screen. So, I'm going to have to stop this movement. Let these guys go in there. So, hope they don't get blasted to pieces. Yeah. So, that whole little plan went out the window. Oh, God. All right, let's just make sure you all those are going in there. All right, so we're going to have to deal with this threat over here. All right, so here we go. Neutralizing. One, two, and three. Let's just throw that on there. Yeah, I'll move because I... And let's do the same over here. Neutralizing. Uh, one, two, and three. So we can cover that. Mortars. Well, you know what? Your mortars can't do much. Mortars can't do much. But I'd still say we need to put him over there. Okay. And delete that waypoint. And, in fact, bring him there. Just bring him to behind there so that he can help out. Because he's got some. He's got some. And where's your HQ? Where's your, your HQ is running. Yeah, no, let's just, let's just bring your HQ back. In fact, put him over there. Uh, for now. Alright. Let's move these mortars in there. Get them a little bit closer. Uh, yeah. Now you're going to have to, mm, you're going to have to go right back down there. You can't, and you're going to have to go in, and you're going to have to go back, and you're going to have to go back. We need no, that's not. Where can I get better vision here? What's your vision there like? It's actually quite good. It's on that road. And if it was there, it's the same. And yeah, no. Okay, you're just going to have to go and hold here. Go and hold. Boom. There. You're just going to have to cover that road. You're going to have to go in here and... I'm thinking there, that's also good. This covers this. There's not good. There's not good. There's no. And there? No. So that's how we're going to have to play it. All right, so let's just play this. Let's just clear out this little escapade down here. All right, let's go. Let's see where we go. Close, close range stuff, so I don't know. I don't know how our tanks are going to do here. Yeah. Uh, 
Those tanks are gonna die there. Yeah, I know he's gonna tank close, close quarter trap. Yeah, there we go, close quarters. Technical advantages out the window. And why the hell is this guy? Oh, that's why. I thought I gave him like five minutes. Uh, tank gone. All four tanks in the Morin. Irritating. Eh? I should have actually brought those tanks back. Oh, God. Hey, man. I should have, I should have actually taken that tank I should have taken that tank and brought him brought him uh, uh, back for range I made a mistake there yeah whole tank unit gone Four, pan four leopards, can you believe it? What the hell is this HQ doing there? What's over here? It's just 21. I don't know why that HQ is sitting over there. Because he's moving, that's why. Oh, I'll shoot you down there. <laughs> Can't believe I'm so irritated I lost my four Panthers here. Because it became a crapshoot. I shouldn't have done. I made a mistake there. I should have brought him back down here. But he came up with me so quick. This damn thing here was it needed resupply, yeah, so I had to put them on resupply. They couldn't just go up there. Now those those are dug in, eh? They shouldn't lose anything.
Yeah, man, this this bloody thing here. Yeah, you need to go here, bro, and then you need to move. You need to move in there, okay? You need to move in there. You need to move in there, or what's left of you. In fact, you need to move in there. Let me just go check the orders for these things. That's my HQ. You need to move in there. In fact, there. Okay, you need to move... How many units do you have? You have two. Okay, you can go there. You can go there because you got six. And you can go here. Yeah. Alright, so you stop there. Stop there. And stop there. You need you need to get there. Oh, he's got like 50 tanks here. So we need to get you back. Alright, so we're going to have to clear this out. I'm so irritated about my... No, the mortar go there. If you're going to shoot, go there. Uh, who are you shooting at? Okay, good. That's a good shot. And you can move in there. And get some cover. Um, yeah. Is, is there mortar? Are you moving, right? Let's move back down there. Okay, good. So we'll just keep this in the ridge here. We'll keep influence over here. And just, I can't, I'm so irritated about losing my panthers there for them. Those uh, leopards, man. Elite 2. Goodness gracious me. 4. Now I hope I've got some reinforcements at the end of this fight. I'm not going to sit with just 2 of these leopards. This uh, irritated me big time here. Yeah. Alright, good. I think that's covered it. He's still moving in there and he's now an old there. Okay, good. So we're gonna we're gonna play it. Alright, that's better. Get go get that rich. Four leopards, can you believe it? A oh, long way to go still. Not even fifty percent. Why are you shooting over there, bro? That's not gonna help.
Ah, oh, shit, man. What's the use of this? Hold. Okay, hold. Hold. Okay, hold. Hold. And where are you going? You're not going there, fool. You're actually going there. And the other one <laughs> is going there. You're just going to hold behind these eyes. And you are holding and you are going in there. Where's the HQ? Jeez, um, I move it deliberately back into there and go on screen. Okay. And you just screen over there. I should have put you in the covers. <coughs> okay. Yeah, these guys are in resupply already. Oh, jeez. I don't even know if I should move you in there. What about there? Go that way and hold. Go the long way. And then you go in there. Oh, you going in there. What about there? Not through him, if idiot. You can't go through him. Yeah. <sighs> Okay, so the mortars can't do nothing. Even the tanks don't destroy these hoes. But I'll shoot one. One there, and one there, and one there. Let's just... I don't want to trit him too much, because I don't have the X's. Because even if he's combat... This game, even if he's combat ineffective, if he's got a few more men in his X's, he wins that X, and he gets that 500 points. Even though you've, like, fairly beaten him you've made him combat ineffective where are you shooting yeah no that's a good shot okay good and you're shooting over there no you're not going to move you're going to go and call and we're going to shoot one there boom and maybe one there and then one on there in fact i should actually do the second one there yeah let's do the third one there and let's do a second one there uh, yeah, okay. Uh, let's go. Let's just see how this thing plans out. Oh, got a tank there. Jeez, on my HQ there. Oh, jeez, that's his HQ gone. Your artillery does nothing to tanks. You might get one or two tanks if you're lucky, if he's in the open. Well, there we got some tanks over there. Well, some kind of. Oh, come on, get that HQ out of there! That's a help. Over there. It's got tanks, you see. How's he shooting me? I'm in the bloody woods here.
How is he shooting me? I'm in the damn woods here. What's this this area? There's tanks here in the town here, yeah, as usual. Uh, what's he destroyed? <coughs> One five. <coughs> hey, I'm in the town, yo. Nah, he's in. He's gone into the town to assault me, right? He should be at a huge disadvantage here. He should, he's got tanks there, right? He's got tanks there. I should clear him out in the town here. Yeah. I should be clearing him out, eh? In the town here. Yeah. I should be wiping him out in the town. He's got no infantry support, nothing. I should clear him out. I've got five guys and he's got nothing. He's just got tanks. I should make mincemeat of him here. I should do it. So let's just see how that... I still say that the combat model is not 100% uh, kosher. I promise you, it's not kosher. These guys are in the town, and he's basically sliced through my infantry here. Sliced through my infantry here. With, and he's got no infantry support. This is, a, this is not, a, this is not a, um, a fair fight for him, eh? So I'm just going to see now. Again, I've said this before. The uh, tanks are overpowered in, in the towns. Remember, tanks can't climb on top of buildings. They've got to go down streets and stuff. And there's 80% cover for my infantry that's already on hold. Uh, this, these tanks should be dead. They should be dead. But we're going to see how this pans out. Let's just see. Because I've had this problem with this game before. Where the tanks are massively overpowered in the, in the towns. And this should be... This should be easy for my infantry here. Yeah. But we'll see now. And yeah, he shouldn't have been able to slice through my infantry. Like, he's got no infantry support. And he's just going with tanks. And may I say this, I've got 70% cover. And I'm in the buildings, in under rubble and stuff. He, he sh this, this shouldn't be happening in the town. But we'll, we'll just play it and just see. I had that problem before. Uh, you and resupply, you and resupply. And you're on resupply. Okay, let, leave these guys on resupply. Let's just let's just play it. These, these tanks are still still slicing through my infantry. Eh? Look at that. Okay, HQ. Okay. Well, there's nothing I can do with this infantry. He's just getting pot shooted there. Okay. This, these tanks. This, this, this series of tanks, they're just slicing through my infantry here. He's got no infantry support. That was a, that was a tank that shot him. But the infantry still hasn't done anything to those tanks. Still nothing. And this tank, this tank here, this tank, he's, he's got three, he's got three tanks and they're slicing through all my infantry here. See what I'm saying? There again, I've just lost an infantry guy, yeah, which is fair enough. He shot this tank from there. Okay, there we go. These tanks should be minced meat. There we go. This, these tanks in there are destroying my infantry. Look at that. Look at that. 
that's that's a leopard that shot that tank from outside. The combat model for tanks in towns, especially infantry, is, is underpowered. Underpowered. In fact, tanks should never be able to do that in town. I don't care if it's modern warfare or Second World War or ancient warfare, they should never be able to do that to infantry in towns. They should never be able to just on with the tanks overrun infantry in towns. This should be death for the tanks in towns. Right, now you are going to move, you are, you both are going to move, I'm going to select the stack up, you're both going to move deliberately into there. And you're going to go on hold. And then this, this, this lot can stay on this side, yeah. That I can do nothing about. Alright, so with, with my tanks, uh, I think we've covered this area. I'm going to bring my, bring my tanks and the infantry up here like I did urgently before I was rudely interrupted by this coming down the hill here. All right, I'm going to pause, pause this and make my moves. I'll get back to you. Okay, so what have I done? Basically, I've sent all the tanks, into the two tanks that I have left there because it gives good line of sight and there because it gives good line of sight for this area. I've taken this, so let me just put this on, I've taken, I'm going to take that off, I've taken this infantry section here and I've sent them directly into the X's over there, these are all going to stay down there, and I've timed them all, they should all be there about, the infantry probably about half past six and the tanks about uh, 20 past six, to give overwatch to the infantry. Um, yeah, that's it. I do want to shoot some artillery, and I almost forgot about... Oh, there, he's ready. Let me go up here. Come on, let me go up. Yeah, I want artillery on there, I want there, and I want back on there. Okay. Uh, these guys, he's still on resupply, and he's on resupply. Yeah, he's neutralizing, and he's on resupply. Okay, good. So I'm going to shoot with him. Mortars, I want the mortars closer. And where are you bombing? Okay, you can bomb there so long. And the HQ's there. Alright, let's fight. Let's just see how this turns out. Brilliant, I want them on those ridges to clear out that infantry. Who is he shooting at? Is it us that's getting blown up here? No, we're not close yet. It's like half. But we've got to be careful now because I've got to bring masses of forces here to get this and control it. Otherwise, this O, uh, let me tell you, this O is going to have one O there and he's got more f power over there. I think I'm going to send one of these gear parts that I've got your anti air up here to claim that X. Yeah. I think it's the only way. I don't want him to lose his combat in effectiveness straight away.
Okay, I think I'm going to send these gear parts down here. Move deliberately there, there, and into that hex and go and hold. Yeah, I am going to do that with him. And there's another gear part here. I'm going to send him deliberately, boom, boom, and claim that X there and go and hold. I'm going to send all these gear parts down there. Deliberately, boom, boom. And, yeah, let's get this X as well. And I'll we'll lead them as they go and then go and hold. So let them just go. There's nothing I can do with this guy. He's not going to... So I'm going to leave him. In fact, I want them there. I want one two o there. And in fact, I actually want him to move deliberately into there. All right? And go and hold. I want him there, and I want him there. All right? And I'm going to keep these HQs where they are. In fact, I'll move this. Which HQ is this? Oh, he's for these eyes. Okay, I'll move the one deliberately into there just to go on the screen so they're not on top of each other. I want to keep shooting on this ridge here. Neutralizing. One, two, and three. Just keep retreating those O's down. Now, I'm going to put you on call and you're going to go Barrage, neutralize. One, two, and three. Yeah, let's just keep throwing on those two X's. All right, let's play this out. Just to trit him down over there, so there's not such massive. Careful, yeah. I need to get mass over there. <coughs> Yeah, I want to bring this whole lot down. This lot on the hills here. Okay, so let's just keep the tritty knees uh, I've got the HQ there, but I'm not going to this neutralize. One, two, and three. I'll just shoot that one there. I want to use all my ammunition. Okay, good. Let's go. Okay, the tanks are moving now. Ugh. On my infantry with the cars and whatever. Whatever! Just do whatever you need to do there. Ooh. Still shooting these O's over here. But I don't want to... Where? What am I sitting at? 4.8. Look at that. I'm destroyed. Look at that. I'm still sitting at 4.8. That just tells you how, li that worth, how little worth those units are.
Uh, yeah, we haven't got much time, eh? I'm gonna keep going. We haven't got much time. I think I'm going to take these guys out of their, their timings here. We haven't got much time. So I better just... Jeez, I didn't realize the time. I'm going to take these guys out of their timing. Make it zero. Jeez, I didn't realize the time. Look at the time. It's one hour and 18 minutes. And 80 minutes between even every single order so I didn't realize that the time has run out the scenario time are you with me yeah I thought we had a little bit more time but it looks like we don't I got so engrossed in this so I'll have to take the timing out this this guy can get a five minute yeah let's make it a five minute delay but this guy, these guys, they, they're timing. Sheesh, I didn't realize that. Yeah. So I've got to bring mass. So I've got to put, I've got to put a lot of mass on there to, to win those uh, things. Otherwise, otherwise I'm going to be out of time here. All right, let's, that's all we can do. Let's just run this. Let's take the times out and realize the timing that I needed here. Yeah, you don't have a lot of time. Yeah, look at that, 11 minutes. I don't have a lot of time. And he's not, he's got masses of units. Yeah, now I gotta get going. Let's go. Proceed. gonna work through that. I know he's gonna shoot some of my O's there. Oh jeez I'm gonna run into a I know what I'm gonna run into yeah. Sure taking big chance yeah bomb me there and on that stack really playing hard and loose hard and hard and fast here I'm gonna have to figure out what I'm gonna do here yeah I'm not even over 500 at 5,000 can you believe it Oh, Jesus, I was a dead! 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 I'm gonna have to do something, yeah. Well, I've got 46 minutes to go. Yeah, he's gonna shoot these cars out. Sure. Oh, goodness. Real 
trouble yeah he's gonna shoot on one stack yeah fuck just over five thousand yeah hard and fast Yes, there we go. All those out. All of it out. Oh, man. All those four leopards out. That's that. That's four leopards gone. Jeez. Okay, so we're going to have to go on hold, yeah. Hold. Hey, now I'm the mooring, eh? Yes. I'll have to go back onto that tree line. You're going to have to do this, but, yeah. And you are going to... You're going to just have to go on hold. And you're gonna have to just you you're gonna have to just go back one. You gotta get out of the stack. It's a stack of death. Yeah, no, you're just gonna have to go back one. Yeah. Get out of the stack of death. Move. 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 Put them on the hill. And hold. That's all. The last. And then this guy's just gonna have to go. You're gonna have to go back up. Back up here. You can't go back there. All right. Good. Yeah, you're going in there. Let's move these those up one. Deliberate. Boom. And we can go on hold. Stay there. Stay there. Stay there. All right. I think that's it. Now, I'm going to have to... Sh I don't know if I've got enough time to shoot artillery, but I'm going to... Call. I'm just so irritated about the... Uh, one, two, and three. Go. No. No. Call. Neutralize. One, two, and three. Okay, good. And then these guys. Okay, I'm going to leave everything as it is. Let's just see if we can. Just to get me out of those stacks. So ready to dot me over there. Yeah. Such is fights. Nothing works according to plan. No, no battle plan survives contact with the enemy. This is an old axiom. And this is what exactly what happened here. Alright, so... I think... Oh, uh, still nine minutes. Hey, those leopards, man. Leaf leopards are lost there. Still carry on about it. It's 
irritating. Hey. I think I'm going to change this leopard's course to this side to help out here. Yeah. He hasn't fired any artillery on me, can you believe it? These gear parts, I mean, I need to get them and change the route of this thing. Oh, shucks! Oh, shucks! I'm gonna bring him back down here. I'm gonna bring him. I'm gonna bring him. Back over here. Just to there. Alright, so there's nothing I can do here. I'm moving this guy up and we'll keep this lot over here. And this infantry here. This garden is X here. Maybe I should bring some of them up. It's 21 minutes. It's not. There's, there's 21 minutes to our orders and there's 21 minutes that remain. And it's, it's going to take too long to bring these guys up here. Why are you moving down there? Just, you know, just do that. Okay, you're moving into the ridge. Yeah, okay. And you're moving up there. All right. Yeah, throw there. I'm going to put you on call and I'm going to throw you. Neutralizing. Where are we now? One, two, and, and three. I'm going to do the same with you. Uh, yeah, you, you're going to go on call and you're going to neutralize. Uh, sucks. One, two, and three. Let's do that. And you're also going to go on call. And you're going to neutralize. One, two, and three. I think he's coming down there, right? Yeah. yeah. Let's do that. And then these guys, this guy's, yeah, you're going to throw there. In fact, you're going to throw on that. And you can neutralize on call. Neutralize one, two, and three. There's nothing else. All right, let's go. That's it. Okay, so we can see everything. Is that going to help us? Uh, shot him over there, but that didn't help. I should actually bring, but it's too late. I should have brought this infantry in there. It's too damn late.
Hey, I'm so mad about losing those leopards. I'm not carrying on about it, but jeez. shooting there on the side there. <sighs> yeah, scenario is never nearly nearly over. <gasps> I bet it's I didn't realise I lost track of the time here in terms of how much time I needed. I'm hoping to get these X's and these, but I don't know. We'll see. Uh, this is not going to be mine. He's got that 5,000 over there. I didn't even have close. I'll have this one because i got enough influence there. Yeah, that's it. That's, that's... Let's see if we... Oh, I don't know. Let me just have a look and see. Yes, I do wish to save the campaign. Let's make it wolf. This is, we'll make it two, because that's the second part. Wolves two. Let's save it. Okay. I got a decisive success. Okay. <laughs> that's what I was aiming for, but I wasn't sure how to... At 52% of starting, look how many units I've lost. Jeez. I managed to kill more than a, a 2 to 1 ratio, but I got all these X's because I was pretty sure... I was pretty sure that he wasn't going to come down here. Yeah, um, jeez. Bit of a... <laughs> An RC uh, uh, decisive success. You know, I grabbed this X and I figured that that maybe he wasn't going to be down there. Because I knew, because of all of this, yeah, uh, and me coming up the road, yeah, and losing those those leopards just, uh, just irritated me. I made some big mistakes here. I should have, on this side here, where he suddenly, those tanks, I shouldn't have let that leopard go. I should have brought that leopard back out here. Uh, yeah, and saved it, and not gone with these with these leopards that were here shooting from distance. But I like the blush, brush, blood ran to my head. Yeah, I want to put in there and stop him there, but that didn't work out. And then, and then, this this area here where I had to go up, I had to do something to go up here because I wasn't sure. Maybe I should have come down here. And then went in there and kept these O's here. Came came back down here. But then the scenario was only five hours. I mean, I didn't realize. I didn't take into to to, uh, to I didn't take into to consideration that the scenario is only five hours. It's a short scenario. It's like a five seven hour scenario, and it was just running out. So I wasn't sure how to attack this one. It's all in the woods here, and I wasn't sure if he's. And then I lost my scouts. I had no vision over here. So, and then I thought, well, time has come now because I know the influence rating. I best send these, 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 these guild parts, yeah, to claim these exes yet because I'm pretty sure he's going to mass over here or come back down here again. And he's concentrating his forces here because I'm here and he knows I'm here. He's going to be concentrating everything from this side over to that side so i thought while he's doing that let me sneak around his the good move with it because i don't think i would have got that 500 might not have look my influence is big enough i probably would have but i thought well let me sneak in these gear parts here on the side yeah, and get him in the back door yeah yeah great fight great fight very i just don't know how my next this next scenario is going to be 
because now I lost all those leopards and the, the scenario design says that uh, you got to, you know, they can't give you reinforcements and stuff. So all those le elite leopards are gone. So I'm just hoping I can get them back. Because if I don't get them back, I'm sitting with w one section of four leopards. I don't think that's enough. I just don't think it's enough. Anyway, great fight. Uh, yeah, again, I'm not really fond of these types of scenarios. You know, these ones with the woods, I just don't think this is realistic. But, you know, in the terms, in terms of what the scenario said, we're in the back. We're, we, we've been left behind. We're like this, you know, this, this rear guard of volunteers and whatever behind enemy lines. So it just worries me for the reinforcements, you know, to supply these, to replace those leopards. Because I didn't want to lose them. I'd rather lose the infantry. I want to sit without any leopards. Anyway, this, well, we'll see. This here, um, yeah, it's not my favorite fight because it's in the woods again, you know, and behind all trees and stuff. And he sits and waits for you. Luckily, he didn't have much waiting for me here. So I was able to get in here. And then I lost the scouts early, so I didn't get any sight. Anyway, good, great. Let's just see who the MVP of this is. Who got? I don't think we got many kills. 37. 38. So this is the second section of the, the 1,001st uh, Panzer Brigade. Second section. Who's that? Who's the second section. It's an artillery. It's artillery. Second section. So it's a, one of these guys, yeah. Just shows you what type of battle this is, that you have got artillery. Yeah, it's the second section. It's this guy, yeah. He did the most. Let's just double check. Let's just make sure. Yeah, he's the guy. He did the, the, the 38. And we managed, we didn't kill many tanks in this. We met, well, she's 36 tanks. I mean, with the Soviets, their units are worth nothing. So when you see 8,000, but they're numerous. You're with me? They, they mean, they, they, they're worth nothing, but he's got like 8,000 worth of units. That's 50, in, in victory points, in calculate, that's like 50,000 units. I mean, it's like, his units aren't worth much. His tanks are like 60 or whatever. If you look at these, these were the T-72s, they're 83 points. But 8,000, I mean, if you consider them to the Panthers, I mean, these are elite Panthers. These things are like 116. There's Leopard 2s. So they're, they're a little bit more, but he's got many, many more units in numbers of unit counters because his values of his units are much less. So you can imagine, you have to shoot thousands of his units out. I know I'm exaggerating, but you've got to shoot plenty of his units out compared to yours. And in comparison, 5,000 units of yours in victory points and him 5,000 units, he's almost double the size in, in actual counters on the battlefield. So when you're shooting all this infantry out, you're not, you're not, you're wide, I mean, they're like one point. So you, you think you're hitting O's and you climb, I mean, it's not. It takes a while to a trip him down. He's got numerous units. So, yeah, so that's, you know, now, that's why we didn't even uh, trip him down so much because we just weren't shooting enough of his units. I mean, 8,000, and we only had only the, the four, four, 5,000 worth of unit points, so we're a little bit disadvantaged. Great fight, great battle. Down the West, German campaigns, 10 uh, battle scenarios. I was hoping for a British campaign. I don't know why they didn't include the British campaign in this setup, because they've got enough units for the British. They've got all the units, but they've gone with another West German campaign, which is great. I mean, I love playing as the West Germans. Just the thing is, the infantry is a little brittle. Like, it's only six units. I think with Americans, it's better. You can get 10 unit, uh, uh, infantry unit sections. And with the British as well, I think you can also get about 10. So the, 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 up to 10 in terms of infantry, eight to 10. With the Germans, only three. So, yeah, a little bit underpowered in the infantry. But anyway, it's a great fight. I think that's it. I think I covered everything. All right. So, Sean from Combat Simulations. Please uh, subscribe to my channel, it's free. And also leave comments, suggestions, watch my videos. Helps me out a lot. All right. All right, until our next West German uh, uh, campaign scenario fight, good day on you.